Now to our nation's capital, where this morning the White House tried to pick up some pieces after dozens of classified documents related to U.S. intelligence were somehow leaked from the Pentagon. Yeah, the documents appeared to include top secrets about U.S. allies in other countries, including about the war in Ukraine. NBC's Bree Jackson has more from Washington. Lee, Chloe, the Department of Defense and the intelligence community are reviewing and assessing the validity of the documents, but U.S. officials say there's no question they pose a national security risk. Sensitive and highly classified intelligence leaked online. The Department of Defense has referred this to the Department of Justice for a criminal investigation. The leaked documents, some of them top secret, appeared on several social media sites. They reveal details about U.S. adversaries and allies, including possible weak links in Ukraine's military campaign against Russia. The State Department is working with strategic partners to get to the bottom of this. To reassure them of our commitment to safeguarding intelligence and uh, the fidelity of securing our partnerships as well. Intelligence experts warn it's not just sensitive information at risk. So I think the greatest concern is that uh, some of our sources, both human as well as technical collection systems, could be compromised as a result of this. U.S. officials say the Pentagon further restricted access to certain documents to prevent more leaks. There is uh, uh, no uh, excuse for these kinds uh, of documents to be in the public domain. They don't deserve to be they, in, the, in the public domain. They deserve to be protected. There are concerns additional documents may be out there, and lawmakers urge the administration to act fast in identifying the leaker and take action. And we're told that members of Congress have been given a surface level overview of the situation and are demanding a more detailed briefing on the leaked Pentagon documents. In Washington, Bree Jackson, News Center, Maine.